Hey everyone, and welcome back to another game of Catan. I am the Wanderer, and today we are playing another ranked game on our Road to Top 100 this season. We have the first pick, which is really interesting. Um, immediately this 8 10 4 is just jumping out at me. Uh, the only thing I don't like about it is the, the lack of sheep on the way back uh, and potential sheep spots because, I mean, there's, the, there's a chance the 10 5 2 is open, but I just don't think so. Like, there's no way I get left that right um, to the sheep port. Yeah, the only thing I don't like about this is the, the ports are just crap, like the, the wood port and the brick port. And is it a trap? Um, other 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 options. 8 4 3, eh, don't love it. I think I'd have to take wheat. I don't mind, like, the 6 5 11. The 6 9 3 is also nice, but, like, you, you don't want to point right here to the brick port because you get uh, ploughed. Oh, sorry, to the wheat port because you get ploughed from the 10 9 2. So I think it's probably just the, the 8 4 10 here. Uh, I could be wrong. Um, but I think it's probably the right pick. Uh, Orange says, you do YouTube, I'm just not going to respond. <laughs> I just don't really want to get uh, people thinking that I'm a better player than I actually am. Uh, we'll look at, sorry, was this blue? Blue is 32% win rate, top 500 global. It's pretty solid. Red this season, 26% win rate, 300 global. Okay, pretty solid. And then orange. Uh, orange is, wow, 40% win rate. Oh, jeez. Top 250 global nearly, so 40% win rate is pretty, pretty damn good. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Uh, okay, he said black. Uh, I'll just say, uh, haha, uh, I post on there from time to time. As blue takes the 9, 5, 10. So I'm not going to race him to the brick port, obviously because the one that's useless for me, and I'd rather double up on the 8. Red takes the 8, 4, 3. So all the ore's gone. Uh, I mean, there's something around this 3 for, for orange, but I mean... What do you take here as orange? Uh, <laughs> so, haha, that uh, could have been me. Yeah, six five eleven or six eleven three is not bad. I really like that six five eleven. To be honest, uh, you get the best brick. You get really good wheat. Uh, the only problem is the the wood to pair with the ore is not great. I suppose if if someone wasn't going to steal this wheat port, like. 6, 5, 11, 6, 9, 3 to the wheat port would be pretty nuts. Um, yeah, what else? What else is there? It's fourth pick's not terrible. I tell you what, if that if that free road wasn't there, that's what I'd take. I reckon that'd be a fun setup to play. So my outs aren't the best in terms of all wheat sheep because of the lack of sheep. Uh, so I'm just trying to think, and the wood port's not great, the brick port's not great. Like maybe this was a trap. But I feel like my ability to trade the ore uh, could be what gets me uh, going in this game. I'm really hoping this 10-5-2 is available. Um, that would be awesome. Okay, so they've gone the 6-9-2. Are they going the 6-5-11? I just... I guess they, they wanted to avoid the play up to the wheat port. I actually think they are. I think they're going to run it, the 6-5-11. The I just... My thing is, wouldn't you have wanted to take the... The wood for the starting wood first. I suppose starting wood or starting sheep here. Um, there's much of a muchness. Ooh, reds out here making deals. Uh, I think orange has just got to take the six five eleven. Yeah. Uh, it's okay. I mean, <laughs> I think red just takes nine ten eleven, which again is not bad. Um, and if red then. Ah, oh, it's blue next, though. See, blue needs the wheat and the sheep, so blue probably takes 9, 10, 11. But then red is probably more likely to take either 9, 4, 3, or 9, 10, or um, 6, 11, 12, right? So I think blue here takes... Uh, blue could take this. Now they need the wheat. Um, yeah, so I think blue takes 9, 10, 11. They need the, the sheep. They could also take 9, 4, 11 if they want the extra wheat. Okay, so red does take the 9, 10, 11, which is what we thought. So the thing is, I just don't see blue ever taking the 5, 10, 2 here because the port, like you get extra brick, but it's not worth it because you just have no wheat. And when there's a free road here or the 6, 11, 12, I think you're just taking, you're taking around the 6. You could also potentially take the, the 9, 3, 4 up to the 3 to 1 as well and play without sheep. Uh, I just think I'm pretty happy though when I get left this and I just build to the sheep port. I mean, that solves a bit of my porting issues uh and it gives me the best all wheat sheep so 
I think I'm going to obviously have to be the devs player in this game. If I can get an early city on that 8-10-4, then that's got to be the goal, right? Wow. Okay. So, that surprises me. Blue says WTF. Oh, he, he's accidentally... <laughs> Okay, so, what are we doing here? Um, I'm a little bit of a loss, because, uh, am I going the 6 4 and playing Sheepless, and then going to the Ore Port? I think so. I think this is the play, um, because here I've just got so much wheat, and it's going to be hard for me to go to the 3-1, to uh, and Orange just has better road building, so I could get plowed to that for sure. Uh, this just gives me double wheat, double Ore, no sheep, but the starting road to get my way to either the 3 for one or the all port. Obviously, the 3 for one would be nice, but the all port's probably not bad. It makes my wheat really hard to block. Um, it just makes me very unblockable, to be honest, because I don't really care that I've got road building blocked. So, I think this is just the play. That's a nice spot for anyone who can get there. Um, do we drop the road first? And are we worried about blue potentially plowing all the way around? I don't think so. So, let's make our way to the all port. Yeah, I don't really need to race red here. Don't need to start a war with him for that. As we roll the eight. Fives, uh, fives are just going to go off for blue. Um, I've just got to be careful because blue could potentially plow me up around here. Again, it's not the end of the world, but oh, great uh, roll in the 11. I should be able to trade ore for sheep um, with someone or even wood for sheep. Like, who's got all the sheep? Red's got a bunch. So in terms of assessing our uh, people, Blue's just got a really tough setup with that accidental settle. It's two rolls. Wow. Um, yeah, Blue's just got a tough setup with that accidental click on the 10-5-2. Um, I like Red's setup. They've got, uh, you know, good road network. Road building's okay, but they also have all wheat sheep. So I think it's decent. And then Orange, if they, get, if they can obviously get to the wheat port, Blue's not going to go to the... They're going to go to the sheep port and the brick port. Oh, no. Okay, they're going to build into the wheat. Interesting. Okay. As we roll the eight. And the eight rolls again. All right, we are a six or a four away from the early city. Uh, blue, uh, sorry, um, orange drops the road. I guess they're thinking they're not going to, like, they're going to get a port eventually, right? And they don't want the wee port, so the 943 basically makes them a bit of a monster. And to be honest, I think only red has the actual road building to, to, to race them there, because uh, orange isn't going to want to race three roads. Uh, as we roll the 11. Hmm... I wonder here if we can get this trade off. The seven the problem is the sevens. Nope. Okay. Uh, we'll just pass here. Uh, brick for wood. No, and everyone's got brick. We'll just have to pass, unfortunately. We just need a four. That's the roll. Okay. Now I've just got to dodge sevens. Problem is there hasn't been one yet, and there's still three more rolls to come. That's a pretty tempting trade. I think I take that. So blue passes, because I might seven out. So uh, that's the other thing I reason I don't want to. Um, red? Does red play an aggro knight here? <laughs> that's such a tempting trade. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'm going to take it. I'm going to take a bit of a risk here. If no one wants to trade, no one wants to trade. They just end up porting for the wood. They... Oh, okay. Poor blue. Poor blue. <laughs> Wow, Blue's just... I'd be so mad. <laughs> yeah, Blue's just going to absolutely just go ham on red here. I'll do the one for one here. That's fine. I think it's a settle for, uh, for orange, but sheep is good for me. And we don't seven out, which is massive. Uh, so I can pop a dev, but I don't think I do that. I think I just... Cop the city, uh, and then I'm waiting for the wood roll. 
<laughs> okay, Blue's just gone full revenge mode here. I mean, the problem with Blue's, like, that's such, it, Red's right, that's such a long, a long road to get there for one, and two, it's like, that's a huge expansion for Red's game, because it's it's another three tile set up, it gives them a massive road network, uh, they know I'm not racing them for the three for one, so I think it, it makes perfect sense. I would do this trade if I could. Uh, blue drops. Is he going to go all the way around? He can just have the brick port. I don't. I'm more than happy to give him the brick port. Again, I suppose if I lose this, it's not that bad. Um, and again, if I lose it to blue, it's not the end of the world. I think for me, it's just get this settle off onto the uh, onto the ore port, and then we can cook. Another eleven. Okay, the elevens have been clutch early. Another five. I guess now Orange has this wheat port. Like, they can just port all the excess wheat for cities. I just Once I have this settled down is when I can start to pop. It's just I've got to get this down. It gives me some flexibility. Orange ports and pops. Oh, we roll this first seven. Uh, I'll just say wood for non-block. I don't think there's any out there. Yeah. Um, I think I'd rather... I don't want to hit blue here by any stretch of the means. Uh, I think we just got to hit the nine wheat... And we steal from orange, right? We get a brick. Um, I'm just going to pass because I'm going to get stolen from here. Red or orange or blue is going to steal from me. Unless blue gets mad and hits red. Yeah. <laughs> they self-block. I might get soloed here. Steals my ore. So, uh, uh, so, not saying that uh, wasn't the block, but... <laughs> I need another 11 here, or someone for it to trade me a brick. Because <laughs> I just don't think there's any wood. Uh, blue, blue may be the only one, but there's orange, Ooh, interesting road there from orange. Um, I'll do wheat for wood. Brick for wood. <laughs> I don't think blue, blue is ever going to trade here. I'll do this. I'll also do wheat for brick. About two wheat for a brick. No, nah, okay. It looks like I'm going to have to pop my brick, which is kind of gross, but uh, I can't though. I genuinely can't because it's like I'm, I'm only on the 11. You know, I'm going to have to run it. I'm going to have to hope I don't seven out, which is so risky, but. So blue plows me, which we could see coming. Another nine. Say so like that. I think we ditch the wheat. Hits the 10. Okay. Losing the sheep just kills me. <laughs> okay, I won't steal from uh, I won't steal from you blue and then they steal from blue. Oh, it's cuz of the bot. <laughs> Man, poor <ball> blue. <laughs> Yeah, see, the good thing is no one's really popping a lot of devs. I just need this settle. If this settle gets off, then I can just pop, 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 and I'm fine. Let's roll. We roll the four. Perfect roll. Uh, that's exactly what we needed. Um... I guess we're just dropping the settle, right? It's pretty much a no-brainer. And we'll pass. Still some orange. I think I take this. Damn, he does it with red. Oh yeah, it's fair enough. Red's on two points. <laughs> uh, that'll be the settle for blue, I think. With the wheat. Okay, they take the wood port and they get onto the eight and the nine rolls. Man, I just need some eights and tens while they're not blocked. Uh, 
Ah, okay, sure. I'll do this trade. That's the settle. Okay, I don't really need the brick anymore either. I don't really care about it. So, and I'd rather red have that spot. Orange plays the knight, probably hits the eight. Fair enough. Takes my wheat. I hope they're seven out now. <laughs> Damn. Damn, that was a good block too. <laughs> and they port for the brick. Probably drop this road here. Yep. I mean, the port's not that bad. Uh, they pop a dev, which is interesting. Uh, I think we just got to hit the nine, right? And we're going to hit orange here. And we get a sheep. Perfect. Blue rolls a seven. Does he just hit the six? I'll trade blue wheat here, no worries. Ugh. Hits red. He said non-blocks, I'm not trading him. He must, he must have clicked it right, at, like, right when I said it. Perfect, that's what we're looking for. Now, I think it's definitely devs here. Perfect, okay, perfect, that's two devs. Now, I could city here, but you know what they say about that second city? I'd rather the devs here for flexibility. And two knights is spot on. Nine rolls. Blue makes a good trade there. Uh, is that a city? Damn, blue's cooking. Six rolls. Okay, nice. We just need some eights and tens um, just so I can port for some more devs. I think now that I've got a couple of knights in up the sleeve, I will play a knight here. Uh, I just don't... Like, blue is probably winning, but it's like, what's the... Like, <laughs> what's the block here? Because <laughs> blue's at six, right? Uh, and they're going to have to... Oh, I suppose they can fight... Um, I suppose they already have road, but they will fight orange for road and red for road as orange ports. Uh, I think we'll play the knight here. Uh, sheep for no block. Uh, red says okay. Uh, we'll hit blue here, I think. We get a wood. Let's roll. Uh, do I trade the brick here? I probably do. Brick for sheep. Okay. Uh, do I ever drop a road? I don't think so. I think I'll just hold it because I could potentially plow red. Uh, I'll just be going to pass. Looking for eights here. Blue rolls a seven. So I think I get hit here on the on the six or the four. Just as long as I don't lose the sheep, I'm okay. Oh, blocks the nine. And he steals from orange. That's going to cause some controversy. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> uh, no knight from red. Yeah, we don't want that trade. Uh, I probably, maybe I did because then an eight or a 10 would have given me two devs. Maybe, but then orange rolls a seven. So these are both non knights, which is interesting. It's the eight. Okay, so we both say yes. And he's got a fish from one of us. Oh, it was a bot. That's fair. <laughs> oh, I got it. Guess the settle. I still think I'm. I'm still think I'm worried about orange here because they can take road. They have a debt like a non knight, and the minute they get a city up, uh, I'm gonna play a knight here. Uh, say or for no block. I don't know if anyone has any, but. It'll be blue if they do. Mm. Is it the nine? I'm just going to hit orange here. Maybe I should be hitting the six as we roll the six. Um, okay, we can't really do anything here, unfortunately. These eights and tens have just not been hidden. There's a good block on the nine. <laughs> what does blue do? I guess they keep going here. Like, now they've got the city. Blue can extend to the eight, three. It doubles up their wood. No, we don't do that trade. doesn't do anything for me. Actually, I'd probably do that. Because then, again, they get two devs from there. Okay, 
I just need some 8s and 10s while they're unblocked. They've been unblocked for so long and I haven't got one. <laughs> oh, actually, I'm going to trade. I'm going to trade red this. It's two devs. He doesn't take it. Okay. 12 rolls. Far out. So I think orange pops here because I'm pretty sure they can. Maybe they don't have an ore. Oh, what's their dev? That's what it is. Okay. It's definitely orange here. Um, let's just pop once. Knight is perfect. It means we take army. And then we have a city now. And it's definitely orange all day. Ooh. Nah. Blue has 10 cards here. I suppose the problem is their road's a little bit capped. Oh, actually, I'll do the wait for shit. Oh, nah. I would do that too, but... Nah, I don't like that trade. I'm just trying to think here. So... I've got army locked. It's not a problem. Um, I don't really want to play the knight yet either. As what is oh, blues going this way to that ten three? Okay. This is another dev, but I almost think I like the. Uh, this puts blue at seven, but they are about to lose roads, so I think I'm going to take the wheat for sheep here. Um, it does give them the settle, but I'm not that concerned because orange should be able to take road here. As the nine rolls. That's two more devs. Nah, I need the second city. Oh. Wait for sheep here. I'm pretty tempted on this. Gives red the port, but it gives me two devs. You know what? Let's do it. I think the devs are what I need here. It's the settle for red, but it's okay. There's a 10. If I can dodge a 7 here, then we're laughing. Don't you dare 7 me. Whew, okay, nice. Uh, let's take the city here. And now we just got to hope for some wheat rolls, and then we can just pop, 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 pop. Blue rolls a 7. Uh, I hope he takes the ore over the sheep here. I mean, the good thing is we have two, so I think those trades were good just to keep up a little bank of them. So blue hits me here, fair enough. Steal some orange, interesting. Okay, uh, drops the road, and that, that caps orange's roads a little bit too. This is interesting. So orange can build three more roads, right? And blue can technically only build three more as well. Oh, this is interesting. Come on, four, I need a four. I will play the knight here. I've got to hit blue and orange, right? Blue's at seven. I can't hit orange here. I'm going to have to hit blue. We get the brick. Let's roll. Four. Perfect. Uh, okay. Let's hit some devs. VP is exactly what I need. Another VP would be amazing. Oh, mono is pretty damn good too. Okay. So, I don't need the knights. The mono, I can... I kind of need to mono. So, I need to get one more. One more settle makes my life so easy. So blue's at seven, but has an open settle for eight, but then orange can take road. So blue two for ones gets the city. Red can sneak road too, so gotta be careful of that. The problem is their production's just so far behind. So blue might pass on five cards here, which would be ideal because it could set me up for a pretty big mono. It's annoying I haven't got any quick settles left, but eights are huge. So red 12 cards. I'm pretty sure this must be a VP. I think red's looking for this. <laughs> red is okay, not you. Okay, so wow, red ports everything. If red taking road is just so ideal here. Okay, great. I can just dodge a seven from orange. Damn it! That's the one card! <laughs> uh, the one roll, not card. Um, damn, that's annoying. I think he just hits the ten, right? It's a good block. Yep, and he steals from me. I'm hoping he just holds onto that ore, though, because I could potentially ore mono here. Oh, orange cities. Okay. Uh, wow. 
We get the 11s again. 11s have just been amazing. Uh, I think I just dropped two rows here, right? I don't think I bother with the port. There's no sheep. Not, no, it's not worth monitoring anything. Let's just drop two roads, open up a settle. There's the eight. Nice. It's not going to say anything here. Um, I just, I, I literally, I mean, I can city and settle for the win, right? So we get a four. There's the city, and then I can just port or. So if I like, there's a few or out there I could mono. I'm pretty confident here. I've just got to be careful. A few sevens would kill me, and I don't think anyone can really sneak the win here. So, yeah, I think we're okay. Oh, orange out here and bless it. That's uh, that's a fair enough trade. Um, I just think, yeah, orange. What was orange asking for a three for one? There is pretty ridiculous. Does the two for two gets the settle? So blue at seven. There's the six. Nice. Let's go dodge some sevens here. Nine. Oh, it's just potential wheat mono. What does orange do with nine cards? I've got so much wheat though. I think I just popped devs. Yeah, thought so. Okay, let's roll. Twelve. Uh, we just take the city. And then, is there enough wheat to win here? I don't think so. Oh, uh, maybe there is. Actually, I think there might be. Because I can just do one, two, three, four, and then one, two, four, sheep and wood, and go here, and GG. Bang. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Perfect, perfect all wheat sheep game there, I think. Um, yeah, we get plus 27. Super happy with that. Uh, we'll look at the dice stats. Uh, wow, the nines. The nines were insane and we went on the nines uh everything else was pretty standard the 11s probably gave us a real good leg up early game uh and then we'll look at the res card stats the dev card stats um who was the other vp it must have been red uh yeah and then the activity stats yeah i mean it makes sense like and then overall we got robbed only the four times because there wasn't many sevens rolled and we obviously had most of the knights uh, yeah, super happy with that, guys. Plus 27. We'll have a quick look at the leaderboard as this is a road to top 100, even though it's only just started to pick up a bit of momentum recently. <laughs> so the base game, we are at 1,014. So 25% win rate and 1,666 ranking. So we are nearly cracked a top 1,000 on our way to top 100. We've been on a much more of a heater recently, so I want to keep that going. I hope you guys are enjoying these ones and stay tuned for some more. We'll see you on the next one. Cheers, guys.